Rahwa is four years old and being treated for severe malnourishment. Her family has managed to get her to hospital in a region where many can't. While there's some baby formula available today, there's no meat, eggs, or milk. Since the evening of June 28, seven people have died of hunger here at the Eider Hospital. Swelling in people's limbs is an indicator of malnutrition, and it's surging in Tigray, according to UNICEF. Mizan brought her child here. When she got sick, she didn't get the proper treatment in our village. That was because of the situation there. She didn't get proper medical help. It's been like this since June, when fighters from the Tigray People's Liberation Front, or TPLF, captured the capital Mekele. And the Ethiopian federal government put its population of half a million under blockade. 14% of much needed aid has entered the region since then, according to the UN, and no medicine. The number of children being admitted to hospital has doubled this year as their families run out of food, water, fuel, and the cash they need to survive. Andrew Chappelle, Al Jazeera.